Okay, so as you can tell from the title and the thumbnail, I'm doing a review on the Fender Squire. Um, it's a great beginner guitar, and uh, that's it. So that's the end of the video, and thanks for watching. I was not serious. I was just seeing if you would uh, stick around. There's the model number, I guess. So, um, it is a uh, pretty good guitar. I got it for Christmas. So that was about seven or eight months ago. Depends on whenever you're watching this video. The only thing I have done to it is put new strings on it because I play it almost every day. So uh, they wore out and uh, they got a bit rusty. But besides that, it is a great guitar. But strings you have to change out anyways. So I'm not, not really uh, complaining about that. But uh. I guess. You should know about the amp. It, it, it came with it. And uh. Oh, is that a pick? I've been looking for that pick. So, uh, this guitar and the amp came together in a package, and it came with three picks and a, a whammy bar, and it came with an extra spring. But I'm not for sure where that is. If you know what the spring is, I think it goes on the back of the guitar. And uh, there, if you know anything about that, please let me know in the comments. And I guess you should uh, hear what this thing sounds like. I do have a uh, pedal, but I will not be using it today. Because this is a review, a review on the guitar and the amp. Um, oh, and it came with a cord. Uh, I got a better cord because uh, I had to get a new one for the pedal. But to make it just on this, I'm going to be using this cord right here that came with the guitar. And uh, I'm might use the capo just because but uh anyways here is me playing it Okay, so here's the sound without the capo. Here's just the E minor. Um, it sounds pretty good. And look at the look of the guitar. It sounds amazing. And it looks amazing too. So this is a great beginner guitar. The, the chord that came with it is like a pretty cheap chord, so it it's kind of loose, so I might have to change over to the new chord. So let's let, let's uh, play some uh, music with the overdrive on and see what it sounds like.
sounds amazing on it. Um, in the way we are, we're just gonna do it. pretty good after you weigh me as long as you don't like go too overboard but it stays in tune pretty good after the these are new strings so they're going to go out of tune for like the first week but now let's turn the overdrive down and this is all coming from the, this is all coming from the amp so too much. Um, so that sounds pretty cool. And if I turn the volume knob up and down, we'll make the other drive sound different. So. And uh, I might be deaf after this. controls so if I turn the treble all the way up sounds pretty cool and that was with the middle turned up to five if I turn the bass up and treble down music and uh, let's say you want to do more of a country feel you can do that too
at the bottom. That's what the both turned up all the way to 10, and these are then turned all the way down. And uh, of course, you got the pickup changer. sounds cool too and uh overall it's a great guitar the only thing uh i would change on it is get a new chord for it because this the one that came with it is uh not very good to be honest like this part right here is loose but besides that great guitar great amp especially if, if you're just starting out um great price too uh, I'm not for sure what it is at this time, but, uh, it's a great guitar, and, uh, this was just a quick video, and, uh, see you next video.